und damit hallo und herzlich willkommen zurück zu einer weiteren Folge vom Spiel Beyond Blue. Als erstes wie immer schauen wir uns ähm, das Video an, was wir noch frei haben, beziehungsweise es sind glaube ich jetzt mittlerweile zwei und danach legen wir los mit der Geschichte. Imagine if I was sent in to go study the Mona Lisa and I come in with a pair of snippers and I'm like, I'm going to need to cut this baby up a little bit to see what kind of chemical composition is going on there. Like, you wouldn't do that, right? We don't have to kill these animals. We don't have to kill to understand. If we could do a single cell, that means we don't need to kill 20,000 animals to be able to really understand that one. We could do our work much more non-invasively. So we are working uh, this year on a new project to deploy uh, tags on orcas. We need to learn more about uh, the diet and how they use the habitat. So by deploying those tags, we get the information we need. It is the least invasive method, it is suction cups. So it is not a scratch on the whale afterwards, which is something we really like. In the deep sea, we use these like robotic claws from the oil and gas industry that gets you the sample, but this is so archaic. So we've been designing something called squishy robot fingers, which are ways to be gentle when we study the deep sea. But I think we could even take this another level. There's some organism, we quickly encase it. It's like a medical checkup. We give it a swab to get its genome. We image it from all directions. We open it up, the animal goes away, and we have more information than we've ever had before. These animals are Mona Lisa's. Our perception of them should change. We should be more delicate. Hydrothermal vents are located on the seabed, often in deep water, but sometimes in shallower water. And they form in areas where new oceanic crust is being formed. You can have 400 degree water here and two degree water over here. It's an accelerometer for chemistry and you can form organic compounds in the absence of biology. Everybody's interested in vents because of the metals, including humans. But the metals are sort of the nuclei for life. When you think about what's required for life, you've got to have an energy source, you've got to have a system that's able to utilize that energy source. And the organisms sort of co-evolve with the rock. And in my mind, that's probably how life originated. There are reservoirs of precious metals in the deep sea. And we do have societal needs for precious metals. It's very short-sighted and dangerous to exploit resources in ecosystems that we don't truly understand how those ecosystems function. Deep sea mining is when people go out and extract minerals from the seafloor. People do this because a lot of the minerals that we have on land are actually being depleted, like copper and zinc. So we're looking to the ocean to get those minerals. We want these minerals for solar panels primarily, and we want them for cell phone boards. It's necessary to advance society and get us off fossil fuels. We simply have no idea about the environmental consequences of a lot of these actions that we're taking in the deep sea. We have tended to go for the quick benefit and we'll deal with the consequences later. Well, I think that has caught up with us. We don't know enough right now to effectively, selectively mine the deep sea without catastrophic consequences. The science has always lagged behind the industrialization. I would like for once to see the science ahead of the industrialization and have the science define the limits of the industrialization. Ja, ich schätze, das würden sich viele wünschen, einschließlich mir. Haben wir noch irgendwelche Anrufe? Ich denke mal nicht. Doch, ich habe noch Anrufe. Natürlich, dann werden wir uns da auch noch mal kurz hinbegeben. We watched the video log from your dive. I'm truly heartsick. I'm furious. 
Where should we start? Ähm. Muss ich da jetzt Enter drücken? Ich kann die Maus nämlich jetzt nicht bewegen. Hallo. The destroyed vent. I couldn't believe how badly the seabed was chewed up. Vents that might have had a fossil record dating back over a billion years. And microbial life that doesn't exist anywhere else on the planet. Who knows what cures we've lost. Your drone's a fallen hero, Andre. I think it spooked the miners before they did more damage. If you hadn't been willing to dive without a map, we would never have confirmed they were actively mining. Who gets the satisfaction of turning them in? We were debating that before you came on. We should jointly report. It'll be stronger. Agreed. Agreed. Now tell us about the whale fall. Could you ID the whale? The whale fall was definitely from the baby's family. The tail fluke was intact enough to scan it. But you are sure it wasn't the mother? It wasn't the mother. The ID matched another whale we know from her family. but it was an older whale, so more vulnerable. Do you think there's any connection to the miners? They did plenty of damage, but I don't think the whale fall is on them. I can pull out anything from the scan log that might be worth investigating. Already have. Can you turn these into dive objectives? Right. Catch you in a bit. Okay. Ach so, ich soll die jetzt noch mal anrufen? Kann ich das? We watched the video log from your dive. Truly heartsick. I'm furious. <laughs> Where should we start? Uh, nirgendwo. Ich würde gerne wieder zurückgehen. So, wir sind jetzt bereit zum Tauchen. Also werden wir jetzt tauchen. Day 14. Arena's analysis of the whale fall shows evidence of toxins from a harmful algal bloom. We have to find Andrea and her family and get bio samples. On a positive note, Andrea's side trip was a success. He found an amazing group of teens who have been nurturing the turtle population back to health. Running out of dive time. Especially if I go home early. Ready to dive. I'm in and okay. This area looks so different at night. I used to love diving in the moonlight. The pod was active in this area as recently as an hour ago. When was the last tracking data for the baby or its mother? Days ago. But they could be with the pod right now and just not making any noise. Okay. Also, wenn ich das jetzt richtig verstanden habe, soll das jetzt das gleiche Gebiet sein? Das würde mich jetzt aber ehrlich gesagt wirklich wundern, weil es sieht so dermaßen anders aus. Da hat sie schon recht. Warum können wir nicht mal eins scannen? Jungs, kann man euch eins scannen? Na, komm, komm, wir wollen ja auch dann was lesen, wenn wir mal was freigeschaltet haben, ne? So. There you go, first waypoint. They'll load automatically from here on in. I have the Explorer drones patrolling to get as many eyes and ears looking for the pod as possible. Do I need the buoys? No, we'll use the hydrophones on the drones. They don't have the range or fidelity of the buoys, but we need speed. Thanks. Mariah, you know that no chatter rule was just for the vent area, right? I'm sorry? I think he's pointing out that you seem distracted. Sorry. I'm back. Talk to me about something positive, Andre. 
Were you able to make contact with the teenagers you were telling me about? They've been helping the leatherback turtle population rebound here in the region. They've developed a nest cooling technology to help the baby turtles. They've also built their own tracking drones. Teens with tech. Sounds like you've inspired some citizen scientists, Andre. Hm. Okay, 12 von 19 haben wir... Ähm höher, ein bisschen weiter nach links. Ja, fast. Sieht aber ganz gut aus. Ja, hat er auch angenommen. Okay. Ähm, da sind noch mehr und da ist noch ein neuer Empfänger. Gut, der Empfänger schwimmt uns jetzt nicht davon. Ich würde sagen, dass wir jetzt erstmal zu den Tieren hin schwimmen. Wollte ich auch noch scannen? Nee, anscheinend nicht. Sich so nah an, vor allen Dingen von links. Hallo, mein Süßer. Achso, ich muss bei dir noch nah ran zoomen. Wegen der biologischen Probe. Ah, da. Unterernährt. Oh, das hört sich aber gar nicht gut an. Und auch mal kleiner. Guck mal doch mal nach deinem Geschwisterchen hier. Das ist irgendwie eine etwas seltsame Ortsangabe. Jetzt ist dir der Zeiger zu der Drohne auf der rechten Seite. I don't remember oh, having dolphins in the dive objectives. I added them because of their role in the disease that hit the dolphin population a few years back. Okay, ich muss nicht zu deinen Geschwisterchen, ich muss zu den Delfinen. Dann. Andre, have you picked up any tags from our pod? No, not yet. I'm gonna widen the radius for the Explorer drones. Muss ich denn auch nochmal zoom scannen? Okay. Der ist gesund. Muss ich das jetzt bei allen machen? Der ist auch gesund. Auch gesund. Ich denke nicht, dass ich das jetzt bei allen machen muss, oder? Leute. Ich gehe jetzt erstmal zum nächsten Ziel. Beziehungsweise ich schwimme natürlich. Ich gehe nicht. Schätzelein. Aber dich habe ich gerade schon eingescannt. Schade. Ah, ich bin fast schneller als der Orca. Oh, wen haben wir denn da? Hallöchen. Und du hast noch Freunde mitgebracht, wie ich sehe. Ich wollte dich aber gerade da. Jetzt geht's. Have you decided whether or not you want another dive back at the brine pool? With everything going on, I really hadn't had the chance to look at the schedule, but I would always say yes to that. Right. So, da hinten haben wir jetzt noch einen Punkt, wo wir hinschwimmen können. Sehr schön. Nach der letzten Folge bin ich sogar doppelt begeistert darüber. I'm near the waypoint and can hear a humpback singing, but I don't see it. I think I'm losing it. It's gotta be close. I feel like it's singing right in my ear. Try a scan visor. Ach, 
Da kann ich jetzt meine Farben ändern. Das kam aber irgendwie aus der Richtung. Nee, es kommt von hier. Hä? Also laut meinen Kopfhörern muss ich mich hier ständig drehen. Das müsste irgendwie von hier kommen, aber... Hä? Da ist auch ein Ausrufezeichen irgendwo hier. Zitrone, aber ich glaube nicht, dass die Drohne was damit zu tun hat, oder? Aber bei der Drohne höre ich das jetzt nicht. I see a scan dot, but nothing's there. I think the humpback is invisible. Sorry. I'm afraid I'm the invisible whale. I'm definitely losing it. I thought you just said you're an invisible whale. Well, not me. The humpback song I generated. You're at a playback station. It's pretty small on the boy line, but in the dark you probably can't see the line. Wow. It must be pretty authentic. At least enough to convince your drone. Ach, ganz oben. Have you heard back from Ren yet? Mm. Is Ren okay? Rai, are you there? I'm not sure. Pardon? I meant about Ren. I don't know. We had a fight right before I left the sub. Do you want to call her now? I can patch you through. Seriously? Here? Well, I have to watch your video feed for safety, but I can mute your audio track for privacy. Wow, I've never talked to her while I was diving. No, I'll wait for the sub. So, was haben wir denn hier? Hätte ich natürlich auch vorher drauf kommen können, dass ich einfach mal den Scanner anschalten müsste. Ähm oh, Hallöchen. Na, geht es dir gut? Nein, ich müsste einmal auf die andere Seite, bitte. Fast. Okay, Mariah, you're on. The drone on the outer patrol just picked up several sperm whales on visual. Thanks. No sound alerts at all. They're being awfully quiet. Okay, auf der Seite. Wir wollen ja auch ein bisschen was sehen hier, ne? Tauchen jetzt mal einfach hier unten drunter. Das war, glaube ich, die Stelle, wo man dann auf der anderen Seite wieder rauskam. Hoffe ich zumindest. Sonst müssen wir wieder zurück. Was bist du denn? Hallo? Weißflecken Kugelfisch. Oh, da sind ja schon unsere Wale. I think I found the pod. Yes, that is them. I don't see the baby, but it's a little dark. Why are they moving? They're sleeping. I had no idea. They look alien. But beautiful. Yeah. If you don't mind. I'm just gonna mute my calm while I get the samples. I don't think they can hear us through your body, sir. I think she is the one that is needing some quiet. Thanks, Arena. Catch you at the sub. Mariah out. Äh, muss ich das bei den anderen jetzt auch nochmal machen, oder? Da muss ich jetzt drei Proben von dem gleichen nehmen. Das nimmt er nicht nochmal an. Hm. Moment, da hinten ist noch einer. Den könnte ich machen. 
Ah, da ist auch noch einer. Perfekt. Okay. Jeder nee, andere. So. Wenn mir jetzt noch jemand sagt, wo der Punkt ist, dann. Ah, da. Geringe Menge an Giftstoff gefunden. Oha. Noch einer? Ich glaube, sie sind gerade aufgewacht. Den habe ich aber doch schon untersucht. Ach so, jetzt geht's. Weißt du, meine Mama ist die Ozeanärztin. Der Ozean ist krank und sie versucht, dass es ihm wieder besser geht. 